Hey guys, today I'm going to be opening and reviewing some sleepover items from American Girl. If you already in my channel, welcome. Be sure to click on the subscribe button down below and the notification bell in the corner to be notified every time I upload a new video. This video is a shopper's gift guide so shoppers are able to determine whether or not they'd like to purchase the set. Be sure to comment down below your thoughts and opinions on each set. You might need to wait up until the end of the video until you see all of the different items in the haul. And I did just want to say a huge thank you to American Girl for gifting me these items so I'm able to open and review them on my channel. So the first set we'll be taking a look at is an accessory set from the Truly Mini line. It's called the Double the Fun Sleepover Set and there's a photo on the front of the box to give an overview of everything a part of the set. There's some socks, multiple different accessories, and there's a blanket as well. So let's open it up. Let's go ahead and take a look at some of the items a part of the set. The first piece here I would say is the main feature item. It is the hooded blanket and it is so soft and cozy, so perfect for slumber parties and sleepovers. On the outside of the blanket, it's teal and there's a lovely design of different food items. There's donuts, ice cream, pizza, cookies, even some popcorn as well. And if you open the blanket up, you can see it has that really soft material inside to match the hood. And you can close it up. I really love how there's a hood on the top rather than just adding in a classic blanket. If you take a look at the back, the design goes all the way across too. The next item is a miniature book and it's called the This or That Quiz Book. And when you open it up, there's images inside and different writing as well. The writing is quite small because it is miniature size, but you could definitely read it if you want to. This one says it's better to give. And another page over here says leader of the pack and it says would you rather and they have different options and then this here is an advice book or an activity book that says what's your friendship future play this fun game with your bff at your next sleepover and there's an image on the front with the pjs which i'll be taking a look at next we open it up there's some more photos and some activities you can fill out too the next two items a part of the set are some drinks and they're strawberry milk. They come in a plastic cup and it's clear so you're able to see the strawberry milk inside. There's also some writing on the front and there's a straw attached to the drink as well. The next item we'll be taking a look at is the plate for the cookies. On the top it says we go together like and there's a design in the middle of a cookie and milk and there's some hearts as well and it's a bright pink color and it's also written on the bottom as well. There's also a total of four different cookies and they all fit on the plate too. So there's the third one and then here's the last cookie. There are also a total of two different pairs of socks. This one again is themed to milk and cookies. There's a milk image on the front and there's a cookie image on the front of this one and they're blue and pink. If you take a look at the back there's some writing. So this side says best and then the other one says friends. These socks are a lot more brighter than the other ones. They're yellow and blue, and there's a heart design on each of them, and they're themed to toast or bread. So this one is peanut butter, and this one is jelly. And if you take a look at the back, again, it says best friends. The last item part of the set is a game, and I really love how it's based off of a real game. It is Dose, and it's the spin-off from Uno, and it comes in small little packaging, and you can open it up, and you can actually play the game as well if you'd like. So the cards are inside, if I can manage to open it up. I think they're all in plastic. So here are the little cards, and then there's instructions so you can play it too. Overall, I would definitely recommend the set. It comes with some really lovely accessories. The hooded blanket is very adorable, and I love the print on the front. And then it comes with some food items, and a book, and even a game as well. In the last set that I just opened up, I showed a sneak peek of the PJs. So here we have them. They're called the Let Sleepover Pajamas. They're all about sleepovers and slumber parties. There's an image on the front of the box to give an overview of the set. Comes with a shirt, shorts, and slippers too. So let's open up the box. Let's go ahead and take a look at the first item in the set. It is the top and it's a long sleeve shirt. It's pink and I love how the writing is gold. It stands out with the pink. It says pizza, popcorn, movies, and besties. All are themed to, of course, sleepovers. So if we take a look at the back, there's Velcro so it's easy to open and close. And the next item part of the set are the shorts. There's elastic on the waist and there's a bow in the middle. It's a bright teal color to match the slippers. And as for the design, it suits the hooded blanket. It has the same theme of the pizza, cookies, popsicle, ice cream, donuts. And then if we take a look at the back, the design continues across and there's ruffles on the bottom of the shorts too. 
And the last item I'll be showing you are the slippers. And there's a donut design on the front of each slipper. They're a lovely teal color. They're very soft and cozy. And there's a tag which can be removed. There is also an activity guide that comes with the set, but it's exactly the same as the one that came with the accessories as well. And I think this is a really great addition to include in the set. Overall, I would definitely recommend these PJs, especially if you're planning on purchasing the accessories. They both tie along together really nicely. Of course, you need some sort of vanity bag when you go to a slumber party or when you go away on vacation. So this set here is called the Don't Forget to Brush Set, and it's a small little vanity bag with hair ties and a toothbrush and multiple other items too. So let's open it up. Now that we've removed the packaging, let's take a look at the accessories. The first item here is a travel toothbrush. And what I love about this is that there's a handle on the side and it's a bright pink color. And when you're using it, you can have it open like so and you can use this as the handle. But when you're finished, this item is separated and then you can add it in and you can store it away for when it's traveling so it doesn't get dirty. And then there's also a toothpaste as well and it's travel sized. It says shine and there's a star on the side too. And then there's also this item. It is a toothpick and it has a teal handle and you can see that there's a clear attachment between here and the actual string. An item that is very common in a vanity bag are hair ties. There's a total of three in the set and they're a pink purple color. And last but not very least, there's the zipper pouch. It's clear so you can see what's inside and there's a blue zipper on the top. There is a ribbon as a handle so you can open and close the set and the zipper does easily open and close as well. There's multicolored stripes along the front with a star in the middle. You can open it up and you can add the items. So I'll just add everything in. Everything should definitely fit because all the items are travel sized and quite small as well. Overall, I definitely recommend the set. It comes with some great items, especially if you're traveling. So we'll close the zipper and everything fits and there's plenty of room to add more items as well. Now it's time to take a look at some Welly Wisher items. The first set here is called the Starry Sky Pajamas and this is clear so you're able to see the set inside. There's an accessory set, the PJs, and some slippers as well. If we take a look at the back of the box, there's an image of the doll wearing the outfit and the blanket also has a hood as well. I really love the theme of this and there's also a pocket for the hands too. The PJs look so gorgeous and they remind me of Luciana, so let's go ahead and open up the set. The first item part of the set is the hooded blanket and it is so incredibly soft. It's a different material from the one that was a part of the Truly Me line. This one's a lot thinner and softer too. It's a mint blue color and as I said before, there's little pockets for the hands, one on either side and this one has a W for Welly Wisher. There's also a hood at the top for the head as well. If we take a look at the front, it's just completely plain and what I like about it is that it has a hood but you can also use it as a blanket as well. It doesn't stand out and you can just have it on the bed like this or else you can turn it into a hooded blanket like so. As I said before, these PJs remind me of Luciana's collection. I love Luciana's accessories and outfits, so I'm so happy it does. It has a star design, and there's also different images too. This one is of a seashell, and then there's a tiara, so if you look very closely, you can see different shapes. It's a midnight blue color, and there's also some purple elements to it as well. If we take a look at the back, there's Velcro, and there's a small tag on the side. And here we have the leggings or the pants. There's elastic on the waist. The style is exactly the same as the shirt and there's some purple designs on the bottom. If we take a look at the back, it's exactly the same too. And the last item part of the set are the slippers. They match the blanket, which I do really love. They're that mint blue color. There's stitching on the top as well and they're very lightweight too. Overall, these PJs are really great. They're perfect for the Welly Wishers and the blanket is a lovely tie-in with the set as well. An item that you normally bring when you go camping is a sleeping bag. This set here is called the Stargazing Sleeping Bag Set and I'll be showing you the tent that's a part of the collection next. So this item is a lovely tie-in. The box is clear so you're able to see the set. It seems like it has a floral theme and it's purple and pink. If we take a look at the back of the box, we have the doll wearing the PJs that I just reviewed and then there's the sleeping bag as well. So it seems like this item is a purple color but on the other side it's teal. Let's go ahead and take a look at the sleeping bag. It's teal on the outside and there's some mason jars. There's also some lights and leaves as well. It says W on the bottom for Welly Wisher. There's a complete different pattern on the inside, but I really do love this extra fabric that's been added around the set. It is sewn up until here, so you can't open it any further, but there is a lovely flower design. What's really interesting about the set is the material. If you can hear it, it does make a crinkle noise. 
when you move it around so that makes it quite realistic and also you can see that there's material that's been added to the head part so it's raised slightly higher than the actual sleeping bag itself. This item here is a tent set. It comes with multiple different accessories as well. There's an image on the box to give an overview of everything included. I'm really excited about this little milk jar and there's cookies attached to the milk as well, so I'd like to see that in detail. But this set is called the Stargazing Garden Tent Set. So let's take it out of the packaging. The first item part of the set is the pillow. It's teal and pink and it's the exact same on both sides. And then the other item included in the set is an essential for camping. It is a torch. It's teal and pink again. That's a very common color scheme for the set. There's a handle on the side and there's a star in the middle and that's actually a button to switch the torch on and off. The main difference between the cookies, a part of the Truly Me set and this set, is that there are a total of four and they were all separated and they were slightly larger as well. The cookies, a part of this set, are all clumped together and there's a total of three. That's of course because the Welly Wishers are for a younger age group, but they all fit onto the plate and the plate is a purple color. My two favorite items a part of the set would have to be the little milk jars. It says milk on the front of each and that's in a purple font. There's a handle on the side so it can be held onto. And what I love about them is that there's a cookie attached to the top. I think that's so different rather than just having milk. And the straws are different colors as well. There's a green one and a pink one. And just before we take a look at the tent itself, there is a small little book called Welly Wishers Wilderness Camp Out, and it's about the Welly Wishers going camping. There's images, and you can read the writing at the bottom as well. The main feature of the set is, of course, the tent. It comes with multiple different accessories and instructions in order to build it, so let me set it up so I can show you what it looks like. And here we have the tent completely set up, and it's a really lovely addition to the Welly Wisher collection. So it's purple and teal, and if we take a look at the side, of course it has that star design to match a lot of the other items and the PJs as well. And I have one of my Welly Wisher dolls here, Emerson, just to give you an idea of the sizing of the set. So you can see the Welly Wisher dolls are slightly taller than the tent itself, but it is really great sizing too. And I also have Emerson wearing the new PJs that I just opened and reviewed as well. Overall, the release items are really wonderful. They're great for camping. They're also really great for sleepovers and the summertime too. Be sure to comment down below your thoughts and opinions on the sets. So thank you guys so much for watching this video and I really hope you guys enjoyed it.